Okay, so hi guys and welcome back. In this video I would like to show you how you can easily add a DVR to your Quanum Cyclops goggles which will let you record your FPV videos. This makes the Cyclops, which I reviewed before, an awesome set of lightweight goggles with DVR capabilities. First, simply loosen the four screws in the corners and open up the goggles to take a look at its internals. You can see the frontal lens. Here, on the right side, you can see the power cables. Red is plus and black is minus. These are directly connected to your 2S or 3S battery. On the left side, you can see four cables going to your monitor, both powering it and also supplying it with the video signal from the receiver. Finally, on the opposite side here one can see plenty of empty space, which we will use for installing the PEC uh, to power the DVR module. Ok, so now let's get straight to it. The only real challenge was to find out which cable from the receiver to the monitor is for the video signal, which is where we additionally want to connect the DVR module. On this photo you can see a bit of my efforts to find this out, and here you can already see the solution. The cable carrying the video signal is the topmost cable on the monitor connector, as you can see uh, in this photo. Here you can also already see that I have connected another cable to it, the yellow one, which will go to the DVR module. After figuring this out, all we need is to get some power to the DVR module. Here I took the power directly from the cables going to the receiver and routed these cables to the other side of the goggles, where I also put the video cable already. You can see this here. You can see the red and black cable providing the power and the yellow cable carrying the video signal. Of course, since the red and black cable carry the full 2S or 3S voltage, depending on the battery you use, we need a step-down regulator to 5 volts here in order to power the DVR module. Here you need to take care, since the DVR module is very sensitive to power noise. I think it has no filtering built in at all. This means using an LC filter is a must here. In the photo you see that I use a Bololu, which is usually very good at power filtering, but in the end it was not enough. It did a good job at power filtering, but I could still see some noise in the recording. In the end I exchanged the Bololu for a PDP with a dedicated LC filter on board, and now my recordings are completely clear. I use the Demon Core PDP for this, but other PDPs with LC filtering on board might work as well. Here you can see how I passed the DVR cable through the head strap to the outside. I only connected the red, black and the, the video, the yellow video cable here, since I only use it for recording. If you use a video switch here, you can additionally use it for playing back your recordings as well. But I found out that I don't use this feature, so I have not connected the other cables. Here you can see the final setup with the DVR module in place, and it not only works great, but it is also a very clean solution. Here we can see the recording quality uh, using the Bololu as a power filter. You can see that there is still some noise in the recording. It is not completely clear. This is why I changed this to the uh, Demon Core PDP with its onboard LC filtering. And here you can see the recording quality using this Demon Core PDP. As you can see, it considerably improves the recording quality and the noise is now completely gone. Very nice quality and I really like it a lot. Well, this concludes this video and I hope you liked it.
The Cyclops are now my preferred FPV goggles, since they are so comfortable and lightweight, and I love the DVR feature for my small birds, uh, which do not have a dedicated recording camera on board. I hope you liked this video, and if you did, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe. Many thanks for watching, and see you next time.